Tippett said that he wanted to make the piano sing again. It's just a beautiful, beautiful work. One that I don't get the chance to play very often. I'm always really excited to do it because Tippett, I mean, rather like Beethoven, has a way of seeing the really broad scale of a piece of music and trying to see how all these different bits will add together to make more than the sum of its parts. It's sort of slightly bewildering at first. The beginning of the second movement, like the first half of it, is a kind of maelstrom of piano, kind of wild arpeggios and weird orchestra cannons, and it's quite a cacophony. And so it's quite confusing to listen to it first, and then out of it comes this stuff, amazing stuff, which couldn't have its impression without this complexity that's gone before it. 